As a three-time Olympic medalist in trampoline and a hopeful contender for next year's Pan Am Games, Karen Coburn puts in long and challenging training hours, six days a week, up to six hours per day. But when she became pregnant last year, that changed. You can usually continue exercise when you're pregnant, but with trampoline, you have to stop because of the impact and everything. So I had to find other things to stay in shape. Karen turned to lower impact and lower risk activities like indoor biking and swimming, advised by her physician, Dr. Karen Fleming. Dr. Fleming says many women worry about how much and what kind of activity is safe during pregnancy. Interestingly, we know that the risks of being sedentary in pregnancy uh, outweigh in a low risk, healthy pregnancy, the risks of being active. Being sedentary can contribute to excessive weight gain, which in turn is linked to a host of other health risks. Diabetes uh, in your future, uh, cardiovascular disease, high blood pressure, stroke. The risk of gestational diabetes and complications during labor also increase. Ideally, Dr. Fleming says women will start their pregnancies already exercising. Canadian guidelines, called the par -Med x for pregnancy, spell out what's safe for each stage. For uncomplicated pregnancies where women have been active, they can continue exercising with adjustments to intensity and safe activities. If women haven't been active, it's not recommended to start exercising until the second trimester. In otherwise uncomplicated pregnancies, Exercise does not increase miscarriage risk, does not increase the risk of preterm labor, and within guidelines, i.e. keeping exercise in that three to four times a week, it does not uh, adversely impact the birth weight. What exercise will do is help mothers maintain a healthy weight, boost mood, and prepare their body for labor, which for Karen lasted 27 hours. Patty cake, patty cake, bakers men. Her daughter Emily, which Karen describes as her greatest achievement yet, was born last September. I always appreciated my body for what it could do, you know, perform these stunts 20 feet in the air. But having a baby and going through that pregnancy really made me appreciate my body more and what it was, you know, capable of doing. And that's why it's important to treat it so well, to eat well, to exercise, because um, you're going to feel good and your body's going to work better work better before, during, and after pregnancy because it's easier to bounce back when you've put in the work. With Sunnyview, I'm Monica Mattis.